this is Brian Vickery coming to you from sunny Denver, Colorado with another video log. I am here in front of the home field for the Denver Broncos, Sports Authority Field at a mile high, to talk about how a strong, successful, winning team can contribute a strong, positive vibe for a community. So the Denver Broncos are getting ready to head to the Dallas Cowboys at 4-0, and I expect them to emerge 5-0 against my childhood football team. And in the process of doing that, they'll probably maintain pace at perhaps shattering NFL records that have stood for quite some time as a 37-year-old quarterback leads a very prolific offense. But I don't care whether you're a small Texas town that basically shuts all the doors and follows those yellow school buses every Friday night to play a heated high school football game, or whether you are a football crazed city that is rooting on your favorite NFL team. When a team is winning, it contributes a very positive vibe to the community. People want to wear the jerseys of their favorite athletes. They want to go to fast food restaurants where they get the cups that have the schedules for their football team, or maybe it's got their favorite athlete's picture, or the logo, whatever it may be. Either way, the whole community and the economy is actually lifted when a team is winning. Now, I'm actually dressed up a little bit more than normal because I'm getting ready to go celebrate with a team I was recently a part of with the Colorado Technology Association. I was one of the volunteers on the steering committee that helped organize the Apex Awards. Now the Colorado Technology Association itself is a team that sole purpose is to promote technology in Colorado, in and around Colorado. So whether that is putting new technologies or new technology ideas together with investors or whether whether that is trying to establish policies at the Hill uh, that can actually benefit technology companies wanting to be headquartered here in Denver, the Colorado Technology Association is very influential in terms of making technology a very robust environment to be in here in Colorado. And so as their events succeed, with the most recent one being Apex Awards, the entire community, the entire technology community actually has an upward vibe. They're excited about what's going on. And just like the Broncos are getting ready to shatter their NFL records, the recent Apex Awards shattered records in terms of attendance as well. And again, this is actually a celebration of technology. It's like who was the technology teacher of the year, who was the technology project of the year, the technology company of the year, or even the technology connection nectar of the year that puts, again, perhaps a company or an idea together with somebody willing to invest in that idea. The Colorado Technology Association is definitely a team that makes an entire community feel better about itself. And I'm actually looking forward to celebrating with this group of volunteers about this recent success and already starting to ramp up for all the next events like the wine tasting we'll have for networking as well as the sea level event that we'll have next year in which you can have people like myself actually rubbing elbows with local sea level executives that have budget that are just incented and want to do business with Colorado business. So my lessons for you are this. One. Root for the Denver Broncos. Root for the winning team. I think it's going to be a very special year, and I'm really looking forward to that. Two, become a volunteer. Get plugged in to a team that impacts a community. So I don't care whether that team is something like the Colorado Technology Association with very much a technology uh, directive, or it could be a Habitat for Humanity, it could be Boys and Girls of Club of America, whatever it is, it could just be youth sports. It could be volunteering in a child classroom. Whatever it may be, become part of a team that is having a positive impact on the community. And I assure you, you will win as an individual the people around you will win, and your entire community spirits will be lifted by such an effort. If only more of us would do more of that. So I encourage you to be the first ones to make a difference. So this is Brian Vickery coming to you from an absolutely gorgeous sunny day in Denver, Colorado. Make a difference in your lifetime. Thanks. Bye.